Hello friends, Monaco here. Um, our second lecture in our acid base unit. Um, in the previous video we talked about how acids and bases neutralize and how they make salt plus water. So we're going to go into a little more depth on that idea plus what an electrolyte is. So you'll be able to identify the basic parts of a neutralization reaction, salt and water, and uh, identify what makes a compound an electrolyte. So we're going to go into depth about those ions. So what happens when you mix an acid and a base? Last lecture we saw acid plus base made salt plus water, H2O. The H from the acid and the OH from the base made H2O and something else. Okay. Anyways, we are going to get into more depth about that. Characteristic properties of salts, because this part right here, that salt, is the first piece of interest. Defined as neutral ionic substances that have a positive ions other than hydrogen and negative ions other than hydroxide. Okay, so table salt, potassium chloride, ice melt, all these different salts are defined as that. Positively charged metal or polyatomic ion and a negatively charged nonmetal or polyatomic ion. Remember, we find our polyatomic ions, I believe it's on table E for our polyatomic ion names. Examples of salt, lithium bromide, potassium iodide, calcium chloride, sodium nitrate. Sodium nitrate contains a polyatomic ion from table E. Salts are formed from neutralization reactions and are neutral. So they have a pH of 7. 7 powers of hydrogen. We'll get into what that means a little later. Acid plus base makes blank. What is it? Salt. And we're going to say a salt because there's many types, obviously. Exception to the rule, NH4Cl is the salt of a weak acid. So it's an odd compound. There's always exceptions to the rules. NH4Cl dissociates to make NH4+. Plus. So this is a rule that's an ex exception to the, four, the rule that doesn't really... You don't have to worry about it. Let's move on. Electrolyte. This is what a salt is. Acids, bases, and salts all are electrolytes. It's a bigger umbrella of a category. It dissolves in water, or dissociates more specifically, to form mobile ions, and therefore it conducts electricity. It doesn't produce electricity. It just lets electricity move through it. Uh, there's a picture of a light being powered by a battery that's just got its terminals connected to the water. Salts, like NaCl, have mobile ions. Acids, bases, and salts are all electrolytes when you put them into a solution. Now, identify two basic products of a neutralization reaction. Say it with you now, salt and water. Identify what makes a compound an electrolyte. It's those aqueous ions. Whenever a salt dissociates, you get negatives and positives. Whenever an acid dissociates, you get negatives and positives. Whenever you get a base dissociating, you get negatives and positives. So, thanks for watching this clarification lecture.